Hi guys, this will be a very short tutorial on how to make a bouncing text animation in Adobe After Effects CS4. So, you may want to look at it how the text basically would be look like. Oh yeah, basically this is it. Okay, let's get started. First thing you have to do, open a new project on Adobe After Effects. Go to the composition and make a new composition. And you can name it whatever you want. Click OK. Then you have to go to the layer, new. And make a new solid. Click solid. And from solid, you may put it as a B, G. Sorry, B, G. As a background, press OK. It doesn't matter what whatever color is it doesn't matter just press OK and from here we need to go to effect and start affecting our animation text okay go to effect and choose generate and go look for ramp click on it well yeah this is what we get so from now on I'm going to affect my background which is I'm going to make this part darker but this part a bit darker too go click on this and change this is already is dark no need just click OK but we want to change the white background from here click on it and scroll this down until we get a bit darker yeah go go oh yeah I think this is enough click OK now what we have to do we have to go and bring the light on the text which I already put again go to effect generate generate CC light sweep just click on it okay from here what you have to do we're going to change the direction press on it and type 90 90 press enter and change the width just a bit decrease it okay 28 well is enough and you may want to decrease the strip intensity to yeah 33 is enough and we don't want to touch that just touch edge thickness just make it a bit cooler yeah that's enough 5.70 oh yeah this is what we get but I'm going to bring it to the center by just clicking on the cursor on the center and just drag it down okay now I want to type my text on this so go and press T for text okay I'll type And if you want to adjust it on the center, just simply press Control and move the cursor on it so we can adjust it to center. And if you don't know whether the text is in the center or not, this little window here, which is for grid and guide, just click on it and choose Title Action Safe. Press Hold control and adjust it in the center yeah I guess now it's in the center just leave it it's up to you which font which size to choose for your own text but if you want to follow my instruction here is I choose font as mesquite and uh, 
the alphabet, the gap between alphabet is 10 and the width for text is 701 as I say it's just up to you whatever you want okay from here we want to apply the bouncing thing okay go to effect look for obsolete and choose pass text okay as you can see this little window will appear I'm going to type my text the one we want to bounce me and of course you can choose your font here whatever you want click OK this is what we get after choosing the past text the background has been changed to black don't worry we can bring it back but now we want to edit the bouncing text I'm going to edit it like this just bring this up Okay, not yet. Okay, just a bit down. Okay, just leave it as here. Well, yeah, you can change the color to anything you want. And also, you can track it to three I think enough but now we want to bring back our original background and get rid of this black thing yeah you have to go and look for composite on original yeah this is it just click on the button here but now we're going to bounce the text the media pro again here you will see advanced just click on it there will be a few options for you so adjusting these four options again I can say it's up to you how to adjust it but for me I'm going to put 20 as baseline and 14 for this that's enough rotation I'll put it as 16 and scale it as 19 yeah that's enough okay now we're going get free of the title save action and just you can play it and that's it I hope you like it